Hello, hello everyone. Welcome to my channel. Larissa is here. 62 and feeling fabulous. Moved to Puerto Vallarta, Mexico in 2021 and since living my best life here. And so can you, my friends. In today's video, we are going to be talking about how much money do you need to live a happy life in Mexico? For most people, lifestyle changes a lot when they move to Mexico. Things that they were cared about back in the US or Canada are not important anymore. Life in Mexico is quite simple and slow. You can live a very happy life in Mexico, especially in Puerto Vallarta, when the sun shines every day, the ocean is magical, and you can have absolutely everything you need at your fingertips. You don't need a lot living this life. You start thinking more relaxed, and that is why while you live in Mexico, you don't need to spend a lot of money. How much clothes do you really need when you live in Puerto Vallarta? Shorts, couple of t-shirts, swimming suit, sunglasses, and one pair of good, comfortable shoes. And you are set up for a year. Making new friends, free surfing, if you have your own board, it's free. Gym. You can stay in a great shape in Puerto Vallarta by simply working out on the beach all year round for free. Living in Mexico is ideal for budget-conscious expats, retirees, and travelers. I can simply answer the question in one sentence. It is two, three times less expensive to live in Vallarta than in the US or Canada. Prices will vary depending on which city you decided to live in. You will find it much cheaper to live on Pacific coast of Mexico versus, for example, in Quintero. But let's calculate in this video how much money do you need to live a happy life in Mexico. Your biggest expense in Mexico, like anywhere, is going to be your accommodation. And the amount will highly depend on where you want to be located city center, beachfront, outside of the city, etc. Living in a good modern apartment near the beach in PV will cost you about 1000 US dollars, utilities $50. And I'm talking from my experience. I live in a modern two bedroom apartment, a seven minutes walk to the beach, and I just renew my rental uh, contract for the next year and I will be paying $1,000 for accommodation versus $1,200 I paid last year. And the link to see the video tour of my apartment is attached in the description below. For a happy life outside the city, you need $400 for accommodation. And very often this price will include utilities. For fast internet and phone service, you pay about $30. So we are at $1,080 for now. Let's continue. To have private medical insurance in Mexico, you will pay $60, $80 a month and have an availability to visit doctors as needed. And as I always say, medical in Mexico is excellent and it's affordable for anyone. So we are at $1,140 for now. Continue on. If you have a car, you will pay around $50 for insurance and $200 for gas monthly. If you don't have your personal car, then public transportation is very affordable here. Uh, the bus ticket will cost you from $0.50 cents to $3, depending on the length of the trip. And also there are public buses with routes all around the bay. 
I give you an example of how much would cost you to travel on a bus, for example, from Puerto Vallarta to Guadalajara, $35. From Guadalajara to Mexico City, another $30, and so on. We have plenty of taxis, Uber, and InDriver is here for you. Now, personally, I have my own car for happy life in Mexico. So, friends, we are at $1,390. Let's continue. I usually buy products of the farmer's market or in special small tiendas. I found personally it's fresher and it's cheaper than shop at the big supermarkets. But there are plenty of modern supermarkets in Puerto Vallarta and the um, selection of food is excellent. So I spend about $50, $60 a week for groceries. I spend some money on vitamins, and vitamins here are expensive. Two, three times more expensive than back in Canada. But the longer I live in Puerto Vallarta, the less vitamins I'm buying, because fruits and vegetables are very fresh, organic, full of vitamins. And also I discovered some super food is growing naturally here. For instance, Moringa tree is growing behind the building where I live. So now what I do every morning, I go and I pick up the leaves from the tree, throw it in my smoothie and the pods or where the seeds of that tree are, the seeds actually, they are uh, very high in vitamin C. So friends, I'm cutting down on vitamins and my total amount for groceries is 250 a month. I usually go out to eat no more than two times a week and it costs me around $200. So equals to 450 total for groceries and eating out. Altogether is $1,840 for a happy life in Mexico. Now friends, if you want to move to Puerto Vallarta, Mexico and become a local in seven easy steps, please send me an email at larissasokla at gmail.com and ask to be added to the VIP pre-sale list. My video course is coming for sale in a couple of weeks. You will get a special price. And this ultimate guide, um, I will share all my experience. I will teach you how to open a bank account, how to save thousands of dollars on money transfers, how to buy a car, how to find best rental deals in Puerto Vallarta, and much, much more. And remember, friends, it's not about how much we have, but how much we enjoy that makes us happy, right? Thanks for watching, everyone, and ciao, ciao, until the next time.